guys, we are in a new location here. We are gonna do a bonus video for this week. I don't know if you've noticed, but I've been trying to do the uploads Monday, Wednesday, Friday, but we're doing a bonus one. And we are going to do a underwear, bra, lingerie kind of haul because uh, I went to La Senza the other day and um, I'm gonna show you what I bought. So I went there yesterday. For anyone who lives in Edmonton, the La Senza in South Edmonton Common is an outlet and the sales and the stock that they have, outrageous. All of the underwear that I got were like $4. All of the bras that I got were on sale for like between 10 and 19. So let's get into it. Also for reference, underwear sizes, I am a medium and bra sizes, I am a 34B. So I'm just gonna pull stuff out randomly and I went in with the purpose, A, to get underwear for like Patreon try-ons. If you wanna see try-ons, that's where to do it. And for like lingerie pictures and stuff for my OnlyFans, all of these are linked down below. But also, because the bras that I have currently are very ratty and they don't fit and they've come totally tattered and apart in the wash. And then a lot of the lingerie I've gotten from Shein, which is nice and it works and it's like low quality for sure, but like it works for pictures and whatnot. But I just wanted some like higher quality stuff that I can wear every day and doesn't look like I've had it for seven years. So spent $250. Okay, so the first thing that I got was this bra right here. It is white lace. It is from the So Free collection and it has like super minimal padding, which is kind of what I'm more into now. Um, I've gotten a lot of questions, especially since I started OnlyFans, about like boob jobs and stuff, because I used to be very vocal on YouTube about how I wanted one. I'm not really in that camp anymore. I'm good not having a boob job, like I, I like my boobs, and I also like my boobs with something that is like a little bit less padding, bralettes have been my shit. I'm wearing one right now, there's zero padding. My nips, they're out to play today, but it's nice, I enjoy the way that it looks. Okay, and then I got this bra, this is from the, also the So Free collection. Oh my God, it is so cute. It's definitely a fuller cup, again with the lack of padding, which is lovely. And then it's got this little detail right here. I just think it's so pretty, like it fits so well, it just feels sexy, you know? This is from the Obsession Plunge collection and it's this like black velvet. Can you see? Like, I'm trying to get it to hit the light properly, but it's like, yeah, there you go. You can kind of see. It's like, it's velvety. I personally hate the feel of velvet on like my clothes, but I can kind of get into it with a bra because it just seems like really hot and really sexy. This has the lift padding right here. So your boobs, they just go like this, you know? I got a plain white bra. This is in the Beyond Sexy, and this is a huge lift. Like, the padding on this, outrageous. But I feel like I needed at least one, you know? I need at least one bra that's like a little extra. That's like, oh, you do have cleavage when you want cleavage. I got reached out to by one of those brands that wanted to do like a sponsorship on my channel and I said no, but it was like a, a sticker that you put on your tits and then you like tape them up. And I just like, it never looks how it looks in the picture. Like I just feel like your boob always looks kind of like wrinkled and folded over when you're wearing those stickers. I don't know, at least for me it has, but I just, this is the only way that I know how to get like a nice amount of lift when you want your boobs to be like up to your chin. I got this kind of bra as well. This is my favorite. This is their Obsession Plunge line as well, but it's got, again, the like padding right here at the bottom of the cup and then the rest of it is nothing. And I like that because it doesn't give you that gap, you know, you know that gap. So it's super nice. It's a little olive color. I think it's pretty with my skin tone. And um, it was on sale like crazy. I do not buy from La Senza full price because it's not necessary. Because everything on their website is like $50, but then you go to the outlet store and everything's like $12, you know? And then we've got some bralettes. So this is from the, what collection are you? It doesn't say a collection. Do bralettes not have a collection? I guess not. But it is this super lacy pink 
bralette and it's really cute. I think this would be really pretty for pictures with OnlyFans. It's got this like double strap right here and I just really like the way that things like this frame your boobs. I'm sorry that you can hear dogs walking around. Like at this point it is what it is. You know that I have like a farm. And then the last bra before we get into underwear because like why not show you that as well is this one. I love this. It looks like high-end lingerie. I feel like some of the bras that Lacenza sells like you know it's good for every day but it's not like sexy you know like it's an it's an everyday utilitarian kind of bra this is like it's an anniversary and you want your man or your woman or your partner to be like oh shit <laughs> okay this is like an oh shit bra you know and then i got a bunch of underwear and i paid four dollars for all of these and then i stole steph's um, like her insider card or whatever and that gave 10% off and then some of these were either further on clearance so like I paid zero dollars essentially I basically stole all of these underwear which is great we love uh, robbing businesses you know what I mean so <laughs> this is the first pair again all of these are in mediums it's this navy blue lacy pair I love things like this for OnlyFans I also love things like that if I'm not feeling like wearing a thong, like maybe I'm on my period or something, but I wanna wear leggings or something really tight, I love a lacy pair of underwear because you don't get the underwear lines. I just don't like them. And then you've got this pair, it's this super pretty silver color. And then the front, it's so pretty. I love underwear that have this kind of like V in the front, it just, it like shapes your body a little bit, like it makes your torso look a little bit longer, which when I am naked or like in front of somebody with like just underwear on, it makes me look kind of like slimmer because it elongates, I don't know. There's a whole thing, but it just makes me look taller and it makes me look like mm, smaller, I don't know. This is my favorite kind of underwear because the side is so skinny, so you think it's skinny. TikTok has taken over my life. Like it is a problem. Like, I have lost a lot of hours of potential sleep over TikTok. But anyways, this is the front, this is the back. It's basically the last pair, but like, mm, skinnier. Did any of your dogs just start barking? Because like, I feel like I hit that octave. And then this is basically the same kind of thing, but it's in kind of like this dusty purple sort of color and a full on lace butt. And it's got those skinny little straps. I just love shit like this. It just like, ugh, it makes your butt look so good like it's not a full butt it's like a half butt you know and then this is kind of the underwear that Lacenza is like famous for it's like the lacy tops and then like the weird front designs I hate <laughs> the panties like the thongs that they sell that have like the dumbass designs on the front this was like the the most tame shit that they had it was just this camo and I was like I mean I do need a new thong because the other ones that I have are just getting old and ratty and then there were a lot that were like really bright colors and said shit like sun's out guns out and like I'm not about it two more I have got this white pair which I think is pretty similar to this one kind of yes a little but I love white underwear I've said this on every platform that I've ever showed underwear in. I think it looks very innocent and virginal. And because of that, it feels sexy. Like wearing this with this bralette, what a leak. And then this is my favorite because I love this color so much. <sighs> Isn't that pretty? Like this little burnt orange. I just get excited underwear shopping, you know? like. Any time I get out of the shower and I put on a matching pair of like underwear or like a really cute bra or something, like I just feel a little bit more confident. Like I'm more excited to put on a nice outfit that day because I feel good in what I'm wearing under that outfit. Like I love my bralette today and it has these like little strappy things right here and I love that. And any sort of shirt that I'm wearing, I think that it's so sexy and it just like peeks out. And like it's such a little detail that really changes how I feel throughout the day and I love that. So thank you for watching me talk about my underwear and um, that's it. <laughs> That's the whole video. That's the whole reason for this existing. Um, I went through and did like an underwear declutter on my OnlyFans and like a bra declutter because like truly, it's just one of those things that I don't go through. Like I just, I wear the same things over and over and over and over and over again. And then I throw them away when they have holes. And it's like, maybe don't. <laughs>
<laughs> like maybe go through it. Like take this video as a sign that like you should go through your underwear and your sock and your bra drawer and just get rid of things that are ratty if you can, you know? Like if there's something that has holes in it or something, I got rid of the strapless bra yesterday that I dread wearing every single time because it squeezes me so tight, like it is not the right size. And it's the only strapless bra that I have. But I was like, I'm not gonna wear it because I hate wearing it every single time. I'm just gonna wear pasties if I need a strapless bra because this is ridiculous, you know? And that's what I did. And I'm proud of myself for that because I hate wearing it and it makes all my clothes look weird because it's too tight and then you get those rolls around your bra line. So anyways, I, I am done with it. I'm done with bras that don't fit and I have new ones and I feel good about it and I'm gonna wash them now. So now that this haul is over, I'm gonna wash them. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs> This is a weird video, but I appreciate you watching. I hope that you enjoyed it. And if you did and you want to see more like this because I'm kind of in like a little bit by a bug sort of thing, like I, I want to just like go on Shein and buy some more like just kind of plain thongs and like some sports bras and then some lingerie. If you want to see those get hauled, thumbs up. And if you want to see pictures or try-ons in any of these, my Patreon and OnlyFans are linked down below. And otherwise, I will see you very soon. Bye guys.